What up, it's your boy Nick Incredible Man, and yes, I am back at it again, and this is Burning Comedy Episode 9, and after last week's episode, I am super excited because, sure, last week's episode wasn't too much going on, but we got introduced to three new members, and we had that whole team building experience going on with Yagoshi, kind of still learning what it means to be a part of a team and have that connection, because he never really had that when he played soccer, but now he's getting that full experience, and dude, I'm super excited, man. Let's dive into this episode and see what's popping off. I don't think I do it good, no, I think I do it great. They would do it if they could, they can't do it, so they hate. Everybody wanna look, but nobody wanna play. Stealing eyes. Is it the captain? Of course. Of course, we knew it. We knew it. Oh, shoot. Oh, he was waiting on... Oh, he wasn't on the side. So they aren't prepared, man. Oh, to get kind of get them used to, like, someone that's fast-paced and everything, right? Oh, it's throwing him off. He's not really sure... Wow. So we're going to learn more about the senpais. Let's get it, man. Oh, uh, okay. This is a year. A battle of wills. So that's his mom? Okay, I see you. So she seems cool. Oh, he took out his tongue ring and everything. <laughs> what? <laughs> My happy days ended all quickly. <laughs> oh, he blackmailed him, didn't he? He blackmailed him. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Man, you better leave me alone. But then he started liking it too. Let's be real. Oh, so they never actually had a full team either. Wow. Uh oh. Yeah. The captain ain't no joke, man. Oh, are we jumping back and forth? Because this is the present. Oh, we get to see some actual matches. Son, you know when he said, like, they gra grabbed a whole bunch of extra players that made me think about I Shield uh, 21. Because he couldn't really help the team. Yeah, you need actual members, man, so you guys can work together, get like a get get a, get a good rhythm, get in sync. <laughs> 
I just can't get over it. This man has no pupil. He just has straight eyeballs. <laughs> oh, wow. So he was a big picture, man. <laughs> Come try out comedy. Oh, he's thinking about what his mom said. Uh oh. Okay, so we're jumping back and forth throughout the entire time, right? This entire episode is is us seeing the present and the future, watching him kind of reminisce and think forward about what he needs to do, right? Well, that's true. Oh, yeah, most of the time a pitcher don't want to give up being a pitcher. But I've also seen Ace of Diamond, and, you know, sometimes you have to play other roles. Oh. <laughs> I figured you might be that kind of person. <laughs> Oh, shoot. I forgot the captain could do that. I forgot the captain could do that. <laughs> I love the captain, man. I love the captain. The captain may be one of the best characters from anime seasons this season. I'm going to be 100%. The captain from comedy is like, hands down, one of the coolest characters. Because he was reminiscing. So this episode is strictly focusing on Misumi, right? And his interaction with Date and everybody else. Yeah, well, he flipped y'all. Ah, uh, they became friends. Wow, because they don't want to let down the team and the captain. Because this is their last year. Nice. That's not bad, man. That's not bad. It wasn't too much going on. Maybe the first half of it was just focusing on that. And I feel like we're going to get something else in the back half of the episode, right? Yeah, man, everybody, like, the team's starting to come together. And I think that's a good thing, especially before they actually dive into a tournament. They need to have that foundation to stand on, man. Uh, here come greatness. Oh. 
Oh, yeah, they had strength, but they never actually focused. Oh, he let his guard down, right? Like he was on guard at first, but then he let it go he let his guard down. <laughs> yeah, they all play sports, right? Well, he's not retreating. Of course he's not retreating. That man, oh, he's so good. He's so good. <laughs> Uh-oh, somebody got him. Well, yeah, y'all, Goshi is different. But he, he's, he's, he's no, he's not the captain, man. <laughs> yeah, sure, 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 sure. <laughs> Hitomi kind of reminds me of um, the comic book dude from Run With The Wind that really wasn't adapted sports, but, you know, he kept running and ended up being vital in the race. Uh-oh, nice. So he dodged that with, with precision, man. Uh-oh. Oh, dang. Yeah, they just... So you can tell that they're constantly thinking now, though, man. Right, because y'all collided like crazy. <laughs> Oh, they actually set up a plan. That was a diversion. The entire thing was a diversion. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, he stopped. Oh, uh, but it doesn't work. <laughs> Miss me has a plan, though. He's not going to give up. He's not going to give up. Oh, shoot. Oh, wow. He, he want to repay his debt. Oh, nice. You see how he's diverting him? You, nice. Oh. Damn, he, he was, son, he was close, man. He was close. All he got across was his fingertips. Ha, 
And you got to admit, that animation when it came to the foot sliding across the mat with the... That was nice. Nice, man. Right, normally we couldn't even touch the captain. You got to give yourself credit, man. You actually you actually made him put up a fight. He had to earn those points. He didn't just get them. He had to earn them. Nice. This wasn't a bad episode. It wasn't too much going on, but it was a nice episode. Right, that, that'll mess you guys up too, though. Everybody finna get a Hisasu. Everybody finna get a Hisasu technique. Everybody finna get a Hisasu technique. Yeah, but you didn't have a full team either, though. Oh, they decided. They decided not to go to their high school, right? I don't know, man. I'm, I'm excited for a match, man. Oh, it's gonna what? I guarantee you it starts, but we're not gonna actually finish it because it's gonna go off, right? Saitama? Oh, so they they they, they didn't come, they didn't go to the uh, high school with Ojo. <laughs> no wonder they're so strong. <laughs> oh, yeah, they look strong. Oh, they, they look strong, man. <laughs> oh, wow. maybe something happened while they couldn't actually go to that school. Oh, he had to take care of his grandma. Uh oh. Sure. Well, he seems nice and polite and everything else. <laughs> oh my gosh everybody else already made it y'all y'all are just oh we're here <laughs> Yeah. 
Nice. I'm excited to see another match, man. Right, probably with the high altitude, you know. That's Ojo, right? Oh, wow. Okay, so dude is good. So dude is going to be good. So dude is going to be good, good. If he if he's anything like Ojo, then that mean all four of these jokers finna get out. Look how big he is, man. Dude is big. Don't go oh no! <laughs> no, no, no. I knew I knew we weren't gonna get it, man. I was hoping we were gonna get just a little bit, but I knew we weren't gonna get it. Okay, man. Ah, shoot, man. That was Burning Comedy Episode 9, and it was legit. Sure, like, the whole entire first half was kind of like a flashback slash, slash present-day training montage for Matsumi and, and, or Masumi, however you want to say it, and everybody else kind of getting that extra hands-on practice and learning how to think while actually playing comedy and not just, you know, moving around without actually thinking of a strategy to go after these raiders and everything. So that was a nice concept to really see because you know that there's thinking involved. You know you can't just hope and, well, hopefully I'll grab these raiders. You know, you have to actually think because if they're anything like Ojo, they're going to be legit. So having him be the one that you practice with, you know, kind of gets you used to it and kind of get a better understanding. But like you said, we, you guys can't practice with me too much because then you'll get used to me and it's not going to benefit you when someone else comes along. Now, at the end of the episode, we see that they ended up having a practice match with two juniors of Ojo and um, the vice captain to have that extra practice match that they need to really develop their skills a little bit more and at the end of the episode when it was getting ready to go off we first of all we see that dude dude is kind of big dude is kind of big man but he gave off a, a strong aura and he he trained and learned how to be a raider from ojo now i'm intrigued to see how that's going to take place and what's going to happen because i feel like Ooh, next week's episode gonna be good, man. This is what it's incredible. Don't forget to smash the like button too. You can't smash it anymore. Comment down below and I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of them and subscribe, but only if you really want to, man. And remember, the anime matters, anime is greatness, and anime is life, man. Peace out. Hey.